Hey guys, it's Chris. From the fruit of the future to rare fruit that costs the same as jewelry, here are 13 of the most expensive fruits in the world. Number 13, Deco Pond Citrus. If you're paying $80 for a bag of something, you no doubt are trying to get something valuable and rare, which is why you might be scratching your head to learn that the $80 in this entry, you're getting nothing more than a bag of orange citrus. Specifically, you're getting the Deco Pond Citrus. This specific item is being referred to as the fruit of the future. And why is that the case? Well, that would be because this is not your standard fruit by any stretch of the imagination. The Decopon citrus is actually a hybrid fruit mixed with Kiyomi and Ponkan, which is a big reason why the citrus looks the way it does. You might look at this and think that this is a brand new creation, when in fact it was created all the way back in 1972. It has no seeds, is bigger than a mandarin fruit, and can even grow to the size of a softball at times. One of the other reasons why this fruit is so expensive is because of its conditions for growth. It has to be grown in a greenhouse with a sugar level above 13 BX, as well as a citric acid level below 1%. It also can't be sold under the name Deco Pond Citrus. So given all of that, you can understand why it's an expensive fruit. Number 12, Designer Bananas. When you go to the store to buy bananas, one of the things that you look for without a doubt is for ones that don't have too much damage or brown spots on the peel, as that's an indication of it being too old and starting to lose its flavor. However, in Japan, there's a special kind of fruit known as the designer banana, where an artist will literally spend their time carving into the peel of the banana to make a special image. It can be something like a train or animals or whatever comes to mind for them. Once done, they sell these bananas for very high prices, usually to the wealthy who can afford to have something more from their bananas. What's more, the price of said banana will vary to certain extents because of the detail of the artwork. Artists like Stefan Brushy, who you can follow on Instagram should you desire, are ones who take great care and detail in doing such pieces. And there are many other forms of luxury banana in Japan that can be bought for some very high prices. Number 11, Square Watermelon. The watermelon as a whole is a very simple fruit to understand, and not unlike other fruits, they're grown in various ways, such as seedless and seeded. In Japan, though, they had the notion that they should try and mold their watermelons to be more compact and easier to stack on their store shelves. Thus was born the square watermelon. The intent was truly to be just what was mentioned in terms of storing space. However, as time went on, they became more than just fruit. They became decoration pieces in Japanese homes. That made these much more valuable, to the extent that a single square watermelon could sell for hundreds of dollars, though the average is about $100. There is a catch to this though, mainly in that the process to grow the watermelons in this shape is not easy and they're costly. As such, they must be harvested before they're ripe, and thus you can buy the watermelon, but you can't eat them. Despite this, the popularity of the fruit hasn't waned, and in fact, other shapes like pyramids and even heart-shaped watermelon have been created and sold for high prices. Germany especially is one country who loves these shaped watermelons. And now for number 10. But first, be sure to let us know if you've ever tried any of these fruits in the comments. Which one did you try? Let us know below and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Number 10, Sekai Ichi Apple. If you were to translate what Sekai Ichi Apple means, you would get the best apple in the world. And due to that moniker and the effort that is put into making these fruits, you can understand why they cost $21 per apple. However, should you need more convincing as to why this particular fruit is made to be so expensive, it's because of the effort that went into making sure that the apples were as perfect as they could possibly be. For example, they're dipped in honey to ensure its taste and look. It's also branded by hand to ensure there are no blemishes on a single apple. When it comes to the care of the orchards, every single apple is pollinated by hand via wands used by the gardener. This is to ensure that nothing is left up to chance, and the perfect apple is made as a result. What's more, the apples are much bigger than your standard apples, as they can grow up to 15 inches. These fruits have been around for 45 years, and because of their size, taste, and popularity, the sales of them grow every single year. Number 9. Sembikia Queen Strawberry 
When it comes to the strawberries of Japan, no effort is wasted in trying to make them the most beautiful and perfect strawberries in the world. And this goes beyond what you might think are the basics of a fruit's look. If you were to look at the Sembikia Queen Strawberry, you'll notice its color first. Not only is it red, it's perfectly red from the top to the bottom of the fruit. This is intentional as they want to see no blemishes on the fruit at all. What's more, they look not just for the perfect color, but also the perfect shape. They're grown in such a way that they're aiming for perfect and even symmetrical looks for the strawberries. If any of them come out weird looking, they're thrown away. The price for a package of 12 strawberries is over $80, and despite that price, most store owners are able to sell dozens of them a day. Number 8. Densuk Watermelon for this particular watermelon, it's not just the shape that helps sell it. It's the name and what's associated with the name. If you're confused, it's really simple to explain. The Densuk watermelon is grown on the Japanese island of Hokkaido, and they are bred to be literally perfect in terms of their shape, their taste, and more. Because of this, the farmers don't go for mass production like most other farmers. They go for quality over quantity. Due to this, only about 100 of these watermelons are made every year. Thus, if you want the best watermelon in the world, you're going to need to pay a good price for it. The average price is about $121, but at an auction once, one went for over $6,000, making it the most expensive watermelon ever sold. Another thing that separates the Densuk watermelon from its other brethren is its outer appearance. Unlike other watermelons, they have an all-black shell that has no stripes on it, and you can consider that a trademark look. Number 7. Avocados If you're looking to find a fruit that's expensive, but also one that's sold almost all over the world for various reasons, then avocados are what you're looking for. Now, in the places of their origin, like Mexico and South Africa, you can get them for a relatively cheap price. However, if you were to go to other countries where they're not as readily available, you'll notice that the price goes up significantly. And why is that? It's because it was discovered that avocados are one of the best foods on earth to eat for a diet, or just a person who wants to eat healthy, and because of this, now they're everywhere. As long as you keep eating them in moderation, it's always easy to go to excess, you'll be getting a great source of healthy fats, nutrients, fibers, and more. Plus, there are studies that say eating avocados on a regular basis can actually help improve your metabolism. As you hopefully know, a fast metabolism burns through all the foods you're eating. And when it's done with that, it'll go to all the fats you have stored in your body, meaning you'll lose weight. Due to this, many countries, including the United States, try to import as many avocados as they can, which drives up the price. This also leads to the stealing of avocados to try and sell them on the market themselves. Number 6. Shidoi Hoseki Strawberry an easy way to drive up the price of an item is to make sure it's a rare one, and that applies to fruit as much as any other item. This can be proven via Japan, and their Shidoi Hoseki Strawberry. It's also known as the White Jewel Strawberry. So what makes this one more unique than any other strawberry on the market? Simple, it's white. Pure white, and it's grown that way, not some random thing that happens. Cultivated by a single grower from the Saga Precinct, Tajima-san crossbreeds between varieties to produce the white jewel and limits their exposure to sunlight. Even under these conditions, only 10% of the white strawberries stay white, further adding to their rarity. But even then, that's not all. What makes these particular white strawberries so rare is that they're bigger than regular strawberries, sometimes twice or three times the size. Each one is sold on its own in a luxurious wrapper and sold for 10 bucks a pop. Though many are eaten as intended, some of them are used as special gifts for others. Number 5. Ubati King Ubati King is a very special kind of Japanese cantaloupe grown in the city of Hokkaido. A simple pair of these cantaloupe can go for up to $225, and that's because of how these Ubatis are grown and the taste they provide. A top-grade melon is to be perfectly round and have an exceptionally smooth rind. A portion of the stem, which is snipped with scissors, is left on top for aesthetic appeal. Some Japanese people present Ubati King melons as gifts during the Ghost Festival. An interesting thing about these fruits is that each plant grows a single Ubati. It's said that this is done so the nutrients from the plant get into the fruit without having to distribute to others. And should you think that $225 isn't too bad for a pair of melons? In 2019, an auction was held and two of these melons also sold at a high price of nearly $47,000. Number 4. Lost Gardens Pineapple 
There are many ways to grow certain fruits to achieve a certain effect. But in the United Kingdom, there's a special pineapple grown in the Lost Gardens of Helgen that might actually turn off some people from trying them out. You see, unlike many modern techniques, the pineapple grown here uses Victorian techniques that are a tad extreme. The Lost Gardens of Helgen employs Victorian techniques that involve growing the pineapple under piles of straw, manure, and horse urine, an unlikely combination that stimulates a chemical reaction that allows the pineapple to grow in colder climates. Now, despite these conditions, the pineapples themselves are said to taste very good. Not that you'll be able to find these on the market. First and foremost, these pineapples are very hard to grow, including some that can take years to grow should the gardeners decide to take that route. However, the other catch is that once they are grown, they aren't given to market. We don't sell our pineapples. They're shared between our staff to thank them for their hard work over the pineapple's lifespan. If we were to auction a pineapple for charity, we feel the right bidder could bid up to 10,000 pounds for charity. This is only a guesstimate and we could be wrong, but this would be a once in a lifetime opportunity that very few people have the opportunity to experience. Those who have tasted it though note that it's sweet and has an explosive flavor. Number three, acai berry. This stuff is awesome. In today's world, there are many superfoods that people are encouraged to eat in order to get better. And a recent one that's been granted this moniker is the acai berry. And it comes from the acai palm of South America. The acai berry has been called a superfood with benefits ranging from improved skin appearance to weight loss, but not all of these claims are supported by evidence. You would usually eat them in a vitamin pill form. One 60 capsule supply runs about 1995 for a two week dose. Acai user chat rooms encourage the use of an expansive cleanser to jumpstart the regime. So it is possible to invest in a 39.95 two-day detox formula. While it's true that a lot of the health benefits aren't proven, some have been, such as having better cognitive functions, helping decrease heart attacks, and are even stated by some to help lessen your likelihood of cancer. As if that wasn't enough, the acai berry is good in nutrition as well. Acai berries contain more antioxidants than other commonly eaten berries. They're also high in fiber and heart-healthy fats. The antioxidant effects of acai berries have largely been attributed to phenolic compounds. Though like many superfoods, it's stated that you shouldn't focus on only eating acai berries. You need to have a truly balanced meal in order to truly gain the nutritional value you require. Number two, Ruby Roman Grapes. Despite what the name suggests, the Ruby Roman Grapes aren't ones that were cultivated since the days of the Roman Empire. Rather, they're from Japan. And not unlike many other fruits that they cultivate, the grapes themselves are so perfect that they sell for a very high price. How high a price? Roughly $26 per grape. And you might think this is an outrageous price, except that these grapes are much larger than the average grape. They're known to individually grow to the size of ping pong balls. What's more, all of the grapes are checked to make sure they have the right sugar content before they're sent to market. I mean, it sounds kind of good, but then how do you eat it? Do you cut it up like an apple or just shove the whole thing in your mouth like sushi? Let me know what you think in the comments below, especially if you've tried one of these. Number one, strawberries and a diamond. Who wants a multi-million dollar strawberry? If you were to hear that there is a large bowl of strawberries at a restaurant in New Orleans that's worth over $1.4 million, think that the people serving that are quite crazy, and you would be right if it was just strawberries. The 96-year-old Arnold's restaurant in New Orleans French Quarter knows how to spice things up. So not only are you getting a very large bowl of strawberries, you're also getting a very amazing pink diamond ring to go along with it. Colored diamonds are some of the most expensive and valuable in the world. And thus, if you were making a proposal to someone and you wanted to make sure the ring was extra special, this would be something that would check all the boxes. Thanks for watching. Can you believe the prices that some of these things sell for? Would you ever think of spending that much money on a piece of fruit? Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe to World List, and I'll see you next time.